Hi, I'm Ashik Rahman. Welcome back to my channel, Accounting Celebrity. Today, I'll show you how to prepare a journal book. Journal is very common question on exam, but many students make mistake. So today, I'll show you how easily you can prepare journal. So let's get started. Look at the question. Here we have one, two, three, four, five transitions. What is written on the question? Show the journal entries necessary to record the following transitions. So these are the transitions you have to record on the journal book. So this is the journal format. Over here we have uh, five columns. First one is the date, then details, then folio, debit, and credit these two columns are side by side you have to put the amount the value of the transitions okay so what is first transition a 2020 july 1st salary paid by check two thousand dollars so let us write here year first 2020 2020 july First, okay. So salary paid by check. Here we have two accounts. Number is one is salary, then we then we have bank. Okay. So salary. What is salary? Salary is an expense. Okay. Business paid salary to its employees. So it's an expense and it is a nominal account. What is the rule for nominal account? All expenses to be debited all incomes and gains to be credited so salary is debited here so first of all we will write the date july 1st let us write here <coughs> excuse me uh, salary salary how much two thousand dollars so salary is debit we will put the value here in the debit column Okay, already you know that FD transition has two accounts. So one account will be debited and another account will be credited. Okay, so already we wrote the debit account. So what is credited here? So you paid by check. So never that check in any books of account. Wherever you see the word check, you have to write bank. Okay. So money salary paid that means money goes out from bank so bank is an asset bank balance is an asset so money goes out from bank that means your asset decreases so decreasing in asset is credited okay so let us write here bank how much same amount okay on the credit side two thousand dollars so we wrote debit account we wrote credit account now we need to write a short narrative okay to write short narrative look at the transitions paid salary by check so write some words from here so we can write here salary paid two thousand dollars okay so narrative is done it's finished then you close this transition okay finished so what is next one paid office rent in cash so what you paid you paid office rent okay how you paid you paid in cash so two accounts one is office rent Another one is cash, office rent. It's an expense, okay? And cash is an asset. So office rent is an expense. Let us write here July. What is the date? Five. So office rent 
office rent is an expense will be debited how much it is five thousand dollars right on the debit column then what is next credit account is cash why is cash credit because cash is an asset cash decreases means asset is decreasing decreasing in asset is credited so right here cash credit how much five thousand dollars okay so now we need to write a short note from the transition okay so we can write uh, paid paid rent by sorry in cash we paid in cash so right here a paid of strength in cash so first now close this transition okay what is next one july 7 what is the transition withdraw ten thousand dollars from the bank account for office use so your business has withdrawn money from the bank okay so what you what you have withdrawn you have withdrawn cash um, cash money okay from bank obviously you will receive cash so cash comes in so cash is an asset it's a real account comes in will be debited so right here july 7 cash okay how much you have taken from bank ten thousand dollars okay then what is next account it is bank so money is taken from the bank that means money goes out from the bank bank is an asset and asset is here decreasing and you already know decreasing in asset is credited so right here bank bank credited how much ten thousand dollars so you need to write a short narrative from here you can write withdraw withdraw cash from bank okay so close this transition so if you are confused how to debit and how to credit then i have a i have a video on it i link to this video in the description you can watch okay you'll better understand so what is next one july 10 wall street in bought a machine bought a machine by twenty five thousand dollars and paid by check two accounts again so you bought a machine you received a machine and then you paid money by check i told you already check means bank so two things are happening here number one you are receiving if an asset which is machine and then you are paying money by check means by bank that means bank is an asset again asset is decreasing so once asset is increasing then asset is decreasing so increasing machine so machine will be debited so right here what is what is the date july 10 so right here machine machine to be debited twenty five thousand dollars okay then you paid you paid money by check bank is decreasing 
so bank is credit how much same amount on the credit side $25,000 so now you need to write a narrative so write withdraw I'm sorry it's not withdraw it should be but it should be but a machine right here but a machine but a machine by check okay but a machine by check finished close it so last one what is last one july 15 purchased goods on credit from mr john three thousand five hundred dollars so what is purchase here okay purchase is here expense and expenses are debited it's a nominal account so right here purchase date is july 15 right here purchase okay purchase is debited how much three thousand five hundred dollars okay then you did not pay money money by in cash or by check then how you purchased you purchased on credit purchase goods on credit means you received goods but you did not pay money maybe you have good relation with the seller seller sold the goods on credit to you did not take money later you have to pay this money so on credit so Mr. John, you owe this 3500 to Mr. Mr. John. That means this money you have to pay Mr. John. So Mr. John is a liability for you. That means your liability is here increasing. It's, you can say it's a trade payable, okay? So trade payable is increasing. That means liability is increasing. So increasing liability is what? Increasing liability is credit so right here mr john same amount three thousand five hundred dollars okay another way you can say mr john is a giver what he give he give you goods okay you are receiver you purchased but mr john is a giver so giver is obviously credit okay so now write a narrative here from this transition purchase goods and credit so right here purchase goods right here purchase goods on credit on pay however you want you can if you want to write different way it's okay just you need to write something about the transition that is narrative so this is how you need to prepare journal book in the exam so if you know journal it will be very good for you to understand how to prepare ledgers and from the ledgers you need to prepare the trial balance and and uh, from the trial balance business can produce the financial statements means uh, income statements balance sheet okay so this is all about to place in I hope you enjoyed the video, you understood and uh, please subscribe my channel and hit the like button, comment below what you want to see in my next video. Bye bye, take care.